Did you know that Harley Quinn wouldn't exist if not for Days of Our Lives? Yes, we mean the soap opera, and yes, we are for real. Here's her bizarre origin story. Follow along. So, Harley Quinn first appeared way before she was in comics in Batman the Animated Series, the 90s cartoon which may be one of the best animated series ever made. Batman the Animated Series was written by Paul Dini, who also wrote for He-Man, G.I. Joe, and Jem, so basically he sprung from the forehead of Zeus, perfect in every way. For story purposes for an episode of Batman, Paul needed a female accomplice to the Joker. He was friends with Arlene Sorkin, who 90s kids may remember from co-hosting America's Funniest People with Uncle Joey. Arlene used to play Calliope on Days of Our Lives, who was bubbly and ditzy and man, she wore really cool hats. I mean, great hats, great A. Paul remembered an episode she appeared in dressed as a Harlequin court jester thing in a fantasy sequence, and he got his inspiration for the Joker's female accomplice, thus Harley Quinn was born. Arlene Sorkin even went on to voice the character for the first few years, developing the character's trademark high-pitched Brooklyn-inspired accent. Get at me, DC. Hear, hear! The rest, of course, is history, given how popular the character is. And rightfully so. So, that's Harley Quinn's bizarro origin. Know of any other characters with weird backstories? Let us know in the comments. Also, let us know if you think Calliope should come back to Dave's, because, man, her hats really were great just don't see a good hat anymore. It's all baseball hats and ugh, that's kind of it. You need like a hat you put in a hat box. That's cool. I'm a hundred so I love hats. <laughs>